Tamara's. We have Kitchen Essentials with Tamara coming up next, so don't go anywhere. Have a wonderful President's Day weekend, everyone. Thank you so much, Valerie, and thank you to you as well. That's right, it is President's Day weekend, and we've been celebrating really all weekend, so I'm glad that you're tuning in this morning. I'm Tamara Hooks, and this hour we're gonna spend in the kitchen, but in a fun way, in a way that really kind of um, maybe can get you some new ideas of what to make for your family for breakfast, lunch, and dinner, and to make some of those dishes even easier to store. All right, but first we're gonna start off, though, with one of the hottest, hottest uh, new kitchen items that we've been seeing everywhere in the kitchens, and that's a spiralizer. This one is from Plate. It's the uh, Plate Spiralizer, and you can see it right here in either the white or you can also get it in black. And I like that it comes in your choice of colors. It's pretty cool. It also comes with this amazing chef's knife that alone the chef's knife should cost the amount of the, the duo that you're getting today. So you've got the chef's knife, so when you need to kind of cut, maybe prepare the fruits and vegetables that you're gonna spiral, and then you've got the spiralizer that you see right here. This is a spring price. It's not always gonna be this price, but we've got it for you now. Free shipping, and we've got it on four flex for President's Day weekend, and John Florell is joining us, and look, he's going with the zucchini, right? <laughs> right. Yeah. It, it spiralizes any solid fruit or vegetable, and, and it, the, the best part about it, look at this. I mean, one continuous piece like this mm -hmm. gives you a perfect garnish for salads, for spiralizing, but it does way more than just spiralize like this. Okay. Now, here's how simple this is to use, okay? It's very easy. You're going to love it. Here's why. Everything compacts down just like this, okay? The legs fold up. You can use this by hand. See, it's got the handle. So you can hold this over the top of a salad and spiralize right into a, right into a frying pan, oh, okay? Good. Right yeah. into a salad bowl. Okay. Or you can pop the legs up and you can do this right on your cutting board or countertop. But it's so simple to change these blades. You just slide this out. Watch what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna push down on the button, okay, and turn it around. Now you've got a julienne, a thick julienne. Mm -hmm. You've got a thin julienne, or you've got the slicing spiral. You lock it in place and you're ready to go. So it doesn't matter what it is that you wanna spiralize, you can do it with the plate spiralizer. Okay. Again, you, all you do is place it on top. Let's say, for example, you wanna spiralize a pear for a fruit salad, oh, all right? I never thought about all that. All you do is place it in here, just like this, slide it forward, all right, and then Hold and turn the handle. Now, all you do is turn the handle, and this will literally spiralize anything right through the core, Look, right all the, the way down to the end. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, and that's perfect. Now, you can stand that up, put a, put a slice through the center, you get perfect slices. All the slices are uniform, they're even, that's so it's nice. not like, you know, when you're using a knife, you get one thick, one thin. Yeah. <laughs> well, with this, you get uniform slices. Okay. And you can do everything from apples, carrots, zucchini, uh, cucumber. Of course, for zucchini, that's what everybody loves spiralizing is zucchini. Mm -hmm. But look at this for your apples. I mean, for an apple oh, salad. Yeah. Or for apple pies. Or if you're into yeah. dehydrating. All apple you do chips. is turn the handle. The uh -huh. quality of this machine is amazing. It's got a stainless steel blade. It, and again, it's so simple to use. You just set it on the countertop or tabletop, turn the handle, and the spiralizer does the work for you. And you know what, John, I'm glad I like that you're not muscling it. You're yeah, not having to kind of work too hard because the spiralizer is really doing all of the hard work for you. Yeah. And I know that you've started to see, you're seeing these kinds of things everywhere. You're seeing them on YouTube. You're seeing them, you know, on your social media. Now is your time to get a great unit that you're going to use all the time. Look at this Look at bell this. pepper. I mean, even with bell peppers, you can slice bell peppers perfectly right down to the end. So good. Perfect for sauteing, mm -hmm. for, sli for sliced Surprise. bell pepper yeah. like this. How about for peppers and onion? You want to do a little bit of onion? You can do onions too. Okay. In fact, I've got an onion right here. We're going to put, we're going to put a new plate up here. Okay. And a, a new plate. Uh, <laughs> dish, I should say, because yeah. the plate uh, julienne or the uh, uh, spiralizer. Yeah. Watch how this works. You place it up to the t to the center here, line it up on that hole. Okay. All you do is push forward mm -hmm. and turn the handle. And look at this. Oh my gosh. You can you can do long strings of of. Uh, 
Your red onion, yeah. yellow onion, white onion, and look at this. I mean, fast that was. one onion done in seconds for sauteing with those peppers. And look wow. at this. I mean, if look at, I'll oh, show look, you, you just to give you an idea. Watch this. Here's one <laughs> strand of onion. Okay, wow. We're, it's almost like you could play jump rope with this. You really could. <laughs> <And then some. laughs> look at that. You really look could. At that. You could literally play do, you know, do jump rope with this. That is and so have fun funny. in the kitchen with this. Now yeah. you dip that into some some tempura batter right oh, wow. into the deep fryer, yeah. I mean, it comes out perfect. You know well, what I love about that, too? Because it is fun. And yeah. maybe you're trying to get your kids to eat vegetables a little bit more. You make it fun for them. Oh, absolutely. And, and this is an easy way to do it. Now, you get your choice of white or black today, okay? I'm going to pull this out. Watch this. I'm going to turn this now, and instead of doing, uh, instead of slicing, I'm going to put the julienne teeth up. And watch the difference. Now, I'm going to do some uh, zucchini pasta. And, you know, it's a healthy easy way to do uh, your pasta, zucchini mm -hmm. pasta. It's healthy. It's good for you. Look at this. Yeah. Long angel hair style julienne zucchini pastas. Now, yeah. if you like it angel hair style, that's the, you use the fine blade. Mm -hmm. If you want to change it, here's how easy it is. You don't have to reach for another uh, blade. You don't have to slide anything in or out. You just turn the knob on the top and now you've got the thicker julienne. And I'm going to do the exact same zucchini here, but I'm going to use that thicker uh, julienne blade okay. and watch the difference now instead of coming out angel hair style you're gonna have more of a spaghetti style oh, okay yeah. long thin julienne like that for your zucchini pastas it's healthy it's good for you and you can make boatloads <laughs> in a matter of seconds you yes, know you can. So <laughs> it saves you a ton of time in the kitchen absolutely let me tell you real quick okay we're showing you the black we also it also comes in white white is by far the more popular this morning so if that's the one you've been looking for to go in your kitchen then go ahead and get it now and I'll tell you, you can see spiralizers at prices like, like this price and so much more. Um, so I like the fact that it's a quality machine, but you're not spending as much money as you actually could. How about potatoes for Ooh, long, yeah. stringy French fries? Oh, yeah. Julianne, your potatoes for French fries. I mean, look at this. It's done in seconds. And, I mean, you can make mounds of French fries. Long, stringy, Best. what did we call these things? Those string, string potatoes, yes, right? Yes, yeah. Now, you can spread those out on a cookie sheet in your oven. Mm -hmm. Sprinkle a little Parmesan cheese or barbecue salt over the top. You mm -hmm. can see them how you like bake them. and then bake them in the oven instead of deep fry them they're yeah. healthy they're good for you i do that and with sweet potatoes yes and, and the spiralizer with sweet potato fries yep <gasps> you're gonna love <laughs> you're going to love and speaking about sweet speaking of sweet potatoes okay. i mean here all we've got one right here all you do is place it up to the top push the handle into the vegetable at the back like this and all you do is turn the handle. I mean, you can make mounds oh of gosh. sweet potato fries, oh, long, thin, yes. stringy French fries, sweet potato style now, oh, and look at that. Nice. I mean, even scatter that around a roast, a ham or lamb in the oven to give a, a beautiful garnish, really? or on top of a salad. You can do carrots the same way. Beets, apples, carrots, zucchini. Yeah. I mean, it does it all, and it does it yeah. safe, fast, and easy. And what we're showing you is pretty much any solid um, vegetable yes. or fruit. Okay, so um, so that's what we're talking about here. And, and don't forget, you're also I, getting that I, you knife. You get this knife, and I got to tell you, it's an eight-inch chef's knife, perfectly balanced. It's got a full tang, okay, which means the blade goes all the way through the handle. The quality of this stainless steel is amazing. You would be hard pressed to find this knife in a retail store for for, <laughs> for less than what you're getting it right. I that's mean, right. for the entire unit. And again, razor sharp. It does the work of well with this one chef's knife, and I. I love the chef's knife because it's the most popular knife. I mean, it is razor sharp from tip to toe. Wow, you can that. slice, dice, chop, do all that with this uh, razor sharp knife. Yeah. In fact, look at this. I mean, I don't know if you can see those slices, but watch this because, I mean, just show you how sharp this is. All you have to do is touch it oh my gosh. and it cuts it. I oh mean, my gosh. It's, <laughs> the hardest thing you ever have to slice in the kitchen is something soft, but with this knife, it's like a razor blade on a handle. And because oh, of the wow. quality stainless steel blade, mm -hmm. it'll stay razor sharp. Look I mean, perfect slices each and every time. It's worth it just for this knife alone. And that's the thing. That's included with this. Yeah, I know. Um, because you'll notice that on the ends of the vegetables, um, John has just cut off the ends, You know, usually the core part mm -hmm. right there on the ends, or, or I should say where the root kind of comes to, to, comes to bear right there. Right. All you did is slice that off, and if you need a good knife to do that, you're getting one included. I'll tell you, I do see a lot of you calling in. Um, if you can use express ordering, that's going to be your fastest way to get in. And if you've been wanting a spiralizer, and I've seen a lot of them, I, I own a, a couple of them at home. Some I've paid 
a lot more money <laughs> for a lot more money for love it I would love this even better because it's just as good it's more convenient it's more affordable and it's easier yeah. to use when you've got all three of those blades on board that you'll never lose. Yeah, and you can do all, again, any type of vegetable, fruit, or, or uh, look at this. We've got a, a, one of these fancy radishes. This is a watermelon radish. Oh, okay. All you do is turn the handle. Now, we're spiralizing oh. this, okay? You can do as much or oh, as little as you like, great. but for garnishing your salads, for garnishing your, like, a, like I said, a ham, lamb, or roast beef in the kitchen, look at that. It's beautiful, and I mean, it's done in seconds. This is why a spiralizer, every single professional chef out there is using spi It's like, it, that's why spiralizing has gone viralizing. <laughs> it really is, <laughs> it really spiral is. has gone viral. And that's why you'll love this because it does so much more things, so many more things than you could do by hand with a knife yeah. and it does it safe, fast and easy. So, I, I mean, even take a, a red beet for example, okay. all right? A lot of people so love beets love. and you know they're healthy, they're good for you. Mm -hmm. uh, but a lot of people, uh, well, beets aren't the, my favorite, but foods that's appealing to the eyesight right. is more appealing to the appetite. And beets are hard and to cut into too. Look at this. I mean, even for oh, red beets. How gorgeous is that? Raw red beets over a salad. Garnish a salad with these beet ribbons like this. And I mean, look at that. It comes out beautiful. It's oh, a perfect garnish wow. for any salad. And it's done literally in seconds. Oh my goodness. <laughs> and, and just so you know, the sound you heard, it's not it. like it's a motor or anything. It's just the sound of the blade cutting right. the, the, the vegetable that you didn't have to physically cut piece by piece with a regu the regular way that you would do it. So. As you're watching, and again, now the white and the black are neck and neck. Everybody's kind of going for it this morning. The spring well, hey, price we won't always have, okay? If you've got a stainless steel kitchen, the black goes great Very in a stainless nice. steel kitchen. Very nice. White's pretty much, you can use it in any color palette, but look at this. Just for onions Just alone. For onions. Slice those onions, perfect, beautiful, and yeah. <laughs> it comes out spiralized, okay? Yeah. How about the potatoes? If you've got kids at home, if the only thing you use this for is you pull it out for that, you know, once a month for the kids or yeah. once a week for the kids to make french fries, yeah. the kids can do this at home too. All you do, and again, I like to show you too that it's it's more versatile than any other spiralizer I've ever seen because you can literally take this right to your uh, right to your table, right to a plate, yeah, right to, right, to right, right over the top pan, of a frying pan, yeah. and all you do is turn the handle. Okay, it's not slipping and sliding all over the place, but you get those perfect spirals like this. Yeah. And all you do, watch, I'm gonna pull this back and do the rest of this potato a little bit different way. I'm gonna change it by po popping this out. You turn this knob, see how it turns that whole thing inside there? Yeah. If you want big French fries, lock that in place. Okay. Now instead of spiralizing, and here, we'll pop, pop the legs up. Gotcha. Watch this, because now instead of spiralizing, <laughs> Now, you're gonna get those long julienne cuts. Very nice, very nice. I'll tell you, this is so great for meal prepping too. If you're the kind of person you like to kind of prep your food for oh, the yeah. week. And you can you can do so much of your cutting Look in a this. matter of seconds. I mean, as soon as those hit the hot oil, they're gonna be done. I know. But look at that, perfect for the, hey, for fish and chips, how would you like to have your chips like this? Yeah, <laughs> Spiralized. absolutely. Woo, those onions are potent. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they getting yard? I'm feeling them. <laughs> I know that um, we're down to our last minute or so, and I know it's so mesmerizing. I know you want to watch uh, and continue to watch and see John, all the different fruits and vegetables that he's going to spiralize. But just think about, these are just a little bit of a, a few ideas. Think about what you're going to do at home. Even if you just start with your favorite vegetables, even if it's just the onion, the potato, yeah. and maybe the zucchini. Those are gonna be fantastic, and then you can branch out to others if you want to. Let's go ahead and see those yeah, sweet even, potatoes even again. Even sweet potato fries. I mean, you can make mounds of sweet potato french fries, long spiral fries like this, and again, you don't have to use it for everything we show you here, but it's nice to know that you can do this. Absolutely. And, I mean, again, just for the onions, you'll love it, but here, I'm gonna change this around. We're gonna spiralize a carrot right next to this, okay. just to show you, because you can do all kinds of fruits and vegetables with it. Push it up to the center, and there's a little tab right here on the top, I don't know if you can see this, okay? Mm -hmm. it, yeah. You push it right over the front of that, 
lock the blade in place. You push the handle into the back of the carrot and watch this, right next to the sweet potatoes here. Yeah. Listen, if you can't get your kids to eat raw vegetables, try it spiralized. Look at that. <laughs> they love it. Oh, These little carrot so chips, it comes out perfect. John, this is so great. Thank you so much oh, for thank this you. as always. John's gonna be back at 3 p.m., but I want you to go ahead and get your spiralizer now so that you make sure that you have yours on the way. It'll be home to you in about a week to 10 days or so, and you can start spiralizing as well. All right, thank you, John. Oh, thank you. And a lot of you are shopping on hsn.com as well. It is President's Day weekend, and we've been talking about it all weekend. We've got some really great specials like we've got at least four flex on everything. And, and I say at least four because in some cases you've got five or more. So if you've been wanting some things, even if they're like the, um, whether it's a lower price or even a, a pricier item, I say get it while you can get it on at least four flex. And that's for President's Day weekend. And so it is Sunday right now. The weekend's gonna be over very soon. Don't miss out on those specials. We're gonna check in with a quick spotlight with Shannon Fox and then come back for more that we have for you. Celebrate President's Day weekend with an unprecedented deal. Save up to $40 on any item when you are approved for the HSN credit card. Yes, $40. As a card holder, you will also enjoy extra flex on jewelry, beauty, and fashion, and VIP financing on select items all the time. Plus, get a $10 coupon when you get your card in the mail. This deal won't last long. Offer ends Monday. Go to hsn.com to apply. There's so many things to love about HSN, but one thing that makes shopping here fun is FlexPay. Get it home now without the stress of paying all at once. Why pay full purchase price today when you can pay over time? Buy what you want now. Pay it off later with your credit or debit card. FlexPay. It's that easy. Exclusively at HSN. and you're watching HSN and we are in the kitchen really making uh, your, your cooking life, your prepping life a lot easier. And we have, well, I would say an item, but we actually have 10 of them that have been so enormously popular, not only here at HSN, but everywhere that they're sold and every time you see these mentioned and reviewed on YouTube and everywhere else. This is the uh, the. Barberware set of 10 reusable food huggers. And I know and these are all 10 that you get right here uh, for multiple sizes of your fruits and vegetables, even two sizes for your avocado. But I want you to see it because I know it's kind of tough to see. Well, what exactly is it? You know how when you cut that lemon, you only needed half the lemon. What do you do with the other half? You seal it just like this. It's like having a second skin. So now you can preserve it better without taking up a lot of space in your, in your refrigerator. You're getting 10 of them for $19.95, which we argue is the best value that you are gonna find. Two of the extra large, two of the large, two medium, two small, and then you get the large and small of the avocado hugger. These are dishwasher safe. Um, you've got a manufacturer's limited lifetime warranty on these. They couldn't be better, but wait until you see how they work. And Kelly Diedring is here. Hi. To show us. <laughs> Good Hi. morning. I get so excited about I these. Know, Cause I, I literally chased food huggers down for two years <laughs> before they launched. I was like, I love this item so much. I have to bring it to uh, my favorite people at HSN, uh, meaning you, because I love it so much. So this is what you do. Let's say you have a cucumber. You slice into half of it. You use this half for the salad. Rather than taking a big old food storage container or a plastic baggie, yeah. which I know we're all guilty of sometimes, mm -hmm. pop on the food hugger. So what happens when you slice into fruit or vegetables is you're actually opening up the skin, right? So now that I've sliced into that, let's say I want to use this half of the lemon. This is now exposed to air particles, which means that's what degrades our food. So many of us know that, obviously, and we would take a little plastic baggie and we may put it in the fridge like that, okay? Right. Unfortunately, this is not good for the environment. It's also uh, expensive. expensive. You have to keep purchasing them because more than likely you're not going to keep reusing it over and over. And you shouldn't, they say. Yeah, they yeah. say you really shouldn't. Or 
think about putting it into something like this. Maybe you have something that's like this. It's still exposed to the air. And by the way, you're now storing this giant container. <laughs> All right, you guys, what food huggers have created is so darn cool. <laughs> All you do, and by the way, don't pull it on or tug it on, pop it on. That's oh, it. That's it. Now you take that and you store it, whether it's in your refrigerator or back in your fruit basket. Yeah. Now you've created a second skin for whatever fruit or vegetable. We're giving you 10 pieces, so they're all different sizes. This is our tiniest size for our cucumber, your zucchini, your squash. Whatever you want to do, you pop it on. But let's say you want to go back in for another slice. Same thing. Go ahead and reuse your food hugger. By the way, these are food grade silicone, so they're dishwasher safe, freezer okay. safe, refrigerator safe, microwave safe. Okay. You can pop them in the oven for crying out loud. <laughs> oh they are goodness. seriously, seriously good, good, good. Now, how about your kiwi? Yeah. Let's say I mean, I'm the one that I do the spoon and I give it to my, my two year old. Yeah. Pop in the other half, you guys. Oh, perfect. Now I'm not wasting it. Because sometimes we know. Don't you, when you cut into half of, of, a, of a fruit or vegetable, you know as you're making that cut, you know what? I'm never, I'm not going to use, gonna use this it. in time, right? And you need to be able to preserve it um, when you want to pop it in your refrigerator or what have you. Same Look. with like, say your tomato. So this is one of our largest sizes. This is the large food hugger. You're only going to use half a tomato. I mean, you don't often go in and use an entire tomato. I mean, no. let's be honest with each other. Yeah. You've got a half a tomato now that now you're storing. You're not using one of these. You're not having to then store yeah. one of these because you're, it's, it's, you're storing a lot of air mm -hmm. here, right? Mm -hmm. So pop this into your refrigerator. If you're somebody that keeps this in your fruit basket, pop it into your fruit basket. Food huggers, it's a its a simple concept, but what a cool idea, you guys. Now, this is the large size. You get All you have to do is choose your size. And by the way, if you look on food huggers um, anywhere else, and by the way... <laughs> They're hard to find right now. They're <laughs> they kind of sold out a lot of places. But they if are. you happen to find them, yeah. you're going to pay 10 to 12 to $13 for a four-pack. For yeah. a four-pack. Yeah. You're get, and then the it, avocado huggers themselves, yeah. I've seen for 10 bucks for they just sell, the two of them. Oh, wow. $10 Wait, for the two of them. Way. So if you add that up, I mean, the savings is unbelievable. Yeah. This is the only place in the country you can get a 10-pack. This is an exclusive configuration that, uh, that we put together. I actually helped put it together. I said, we have to give them more mm -hmm. than you can find any anywhere else. You're getting every color that you see. And if you want to store it, it all nests together. So you, any utility drawer. Oh my gosh, it's so easy. I mean, look at how easy it is to store. Yeah. And speaking of storing, let's pop down to our refrigerator drawers. Okay. Because okay. this to me blew my mind. <laughs> look at this. This is the same amount of fruit and vegetables stored in each one of these, you guys. Okay. This is an onion. It's a half an onion. Mm -hmm. Let me open it up and prove it to you. All right. Half an onion, half a lime, yeah. Half a lemon, okay? Now, you might have smaller, a little bit smaller, but they don't make them too much smaller, That's you guys. That's true. So I can store about three of those in my refrigerator if I can find the lid that fits. That's true. Look at this drawer. I could probably fit a dozen more pieces. Easily. This is the storage difference, okay? And you're not using the plastic baggies. You're not using the disposable, that throwaway wrap. Mm. You're using reusable, dishwasher safe, mm. easy to clean, easy to pop on food yeah. huggers. And I love them. And like you said, you're not storing air because we know air is the enemy of freshness. Yes. It just is. It's just like for yourself. When you cut the vegetable you're, or fruit, you're cutting the skin. Just like if you cut your own skin and then what happens, you know? It's exposed it, to the air. That's right. And that's you how you get infections. Away to, that's yep. exactly yes, right. Right. So this, it's just, it's so simple and it makes so much sense. And I know it looks different than these and the plastic bags that we've always oh, used. I mean, but, it's revolutionary. But it is. It's Step so up neat. and try something better. So it also can be doubled as a lid, okay? So also, like, if you have cat food or baby food, um, yeah. I use this all the time for, like, let's say this lid goes bye-bye, you lose it, or you still want to reuse it. it, you drop yeah. it. Add that food hugger to the top, just find the right size. This, for me, my son, these are the little organic <gasps> fruit cups. Yeah. He'll eat about a half of one. My mom does that. Yes, and then <laughs> and then I've, all, I've, I've, th I've already removed this and thrown it away and so now I just instead of having to dump the rest of the fruit in I pop on my food hugger so these are good for a look at the, you know the cat food dog food mm. what are you going to do with it once you open it if yeah. you put it in your refrigerator it starts oh. to your whole refrigerator starts to smell of cat yeah. food or dog food horrible it's a great idea for sort of lids and these are our craft jars by the way mason jars yeah. it fits on the top of a mason jar oh, if so you, my juice yes your juice or whatever you want to 
to do with it. You can see all the different examples. Let's say you lose lids or they yeah. walk away. This is like our face cream if a lid walks away. Yeah. However you want to use it, most of the time you're going to use it for your fruits and vegetables. Okay. Here's another couple of cool ideas. <laughs> uh, this never happens in my house because typically say. when I pour a glass of wine, my friends, it goes, you know, yeah, down my throat. Right. But there's nothing to store. Yeah, there's nothing to store. <laughs> but let's say you're walking away for an hour or two. You don't want the dust and, you know, particles to settle into your wine. Pop it on the top there. Yeah. Um, sodas, milk, orange juice. You can see, I mean, I'm, you wouldn't turn this upside down, but I'm just going to show you. It just pops right on. Yeah. So let's say you have milk in there, orange juice, soda. Pop it on the top there. This Same for so stuff like this that has, you know, like a little spout, which normally yeah. doesn't come with a lid. Yeah. Just pop it on top. So it, all of those alternate uses I really like oh, as well. Oh, like I hadn't thought about that. Isn't that a good that. idea? I'm so glad. You can see Kelly's giving us a lot of ideas. So you're going to get it and fall in love with it because of the fruit and vegetable storage, but you're going to hoard them yes. because of all the other and things. And don't let them walk away. Don't let your no. friends take them. You're going to use them. They're going to get them yeah. to buy their own set, don't you guys. Say, well, you have 10. Can I just have this one? Because this is the deal. You're getting 10. Yeah. You're getting 10, but you're not paying for what you would be paying if you were going to go out and buy 10 out at the stores. Now, if you need more than 10, because you're saying this is too good for me to keep, I want to share them with uh, family and friends, you can buy more and save on shipping. You're already saving just on getting the 10 pack that only HSN has. But if you want to save even more, then you're saving on shipping. It makes it fantastic. And this weekend, we don't normally do four flex on a $19 price, but this weekend, <laughs> yeah, what does that we make are it? $4.99. <laughs> That's insane, you guys. Seriously, if you're wondering about them and you're curious, look online. You cannot find a 10 pack anywhere, and you're going to pay about $10 to $12 for a four pack, okay? Great. So these are the large ones. You pop, let me actually, I'll probably need a medium one for this orange. Okay. So you just determine what size you need, and all you do is <laughs> pop it into place. This so easy. I'm going to eat this half of the orange. What am I going to do with this half of the orange? So rather than take it and put it in a plastic bag, you know, Mm -hmm. the plastic bag that I'm going to use once and then it goes into a landfill and then I have to go buy more plastic bags. Mm -hmm. Pop your food hugger on it. I love them because they're brightly colored so you're never going to miss. You're yeah. going to eat your fruits and vegetables. You're going to see them inside mm -hmm. your refrigerator but their motto is if you love your food then hug it. And Aww. I think that's such a cool <laughs> motto because let's be honest we do love our food not only because it nourishes our bodies and that's what keeps us healthy and fit mm -hmm. and all that mm -hmm. but we spend a lot of money on our food. Yeah. The moment you cut in to that skin you are opening up uh, you know sort of these plant cell walls of your mm -hmm. fruits and vegetables mm -hmm. and by the way you can keep cutting it and cutting it so let's say I want another maybe I just wanted this for a, a cocktail I can right. just take it out cut it pop it back into my food hugger that yeah. one I keep trying on that one that one's too big let me okay. do the medium but th so that's all you have to do is pick your size that's so and then you can put it back so it doesn't have it doesn't have to be that you're having it every time you can yeah. take it in quarters but yeah. look at our tomato to me that's a big one I never I, use a whole tomato the tomato yep. you're right the zucchini, it's the same kind of way. The onion is the same kind of way. You might, you know, have things in your refrigerator right this second, and you're mm -hmm. saying, I wish I had that right now. Now, you order it, you'll have it in about a week or so, and then you can use them till your heart's content. Yes. But I know you're thinking, I wish I had that right now. now. <laughs> you're getting 10 of them, and we can't even stress that enough because they are hard to find everywhere. They're available in other places, but not in a 10-pack. And the reason they're hard to find, though, in other places is because they keep selling out. Because they're all the rage. Because they're this good. They're like, really good. Kelly literally chased down. I did. The company for they two they years. were brand new. They were just <laughs> launching. I saw an internet video that I don't even know how I happened upon, and I was like, if I don't, if I am not able to bring that to our customers at HSN, it's going to break my heart. That is how much I love these. Mm -hmm. That's how passionate I am. I have so much fruit and vegetables that I have a triple layer fruit and vegetable bowl. It's like three layers. Okay, oh, so oh good. I keep a lot. Of fruit and vegetables, and so yeah. I know what it's like to have to try and store them. So, yeah. just, just, let's say I have this half a lime. I literally, and then I go in my my food storage drawer, and I, that's all I have left. Let's say that's I don't have anything. And now, I mean, this is what I'm left doing, or yeah. I'm left, you know, with the, the baggies, baggie. which I absolutely hate. What about the dreaded wrap? Do you or still yes, have the plastic yeah, like, wrap that's just or the, the foil, tin, the foil or the plastic wrap that always falls off. Well, and, and it's it's not reusable. No. So you know, we get to the point where we just unfortunately we want a solution and not yeah. something 
something we have to keep buying over and Absolutely. over again. Show me the avocado too, because remember you're getting yes, two sorry, sizes for thank the you. avocado. So you're getting both sizes. By the way, if you look in the marketplace, do a quick online search. They're about 10 bucks for, for the two pack, okay? okay? You're getting these included. So this is for like the Florida avocados, the larger ones, mm -hmm. and you're getting the large one. And then this is just for your traditional Haas awesome. avocado. Yeah. And you can keep the pit in, or I was showing Tamara, um, you can keep the pit out, however you want to do it. Now you yeah. should probably store it with the pit in. It'll keep it a little bit fresher. But yeah. if you, for some reason, the pit fell out, it'll just pop in there. I, yeah. I mean, that's what I'm saying. And you're getting both of these included. Um, so maybe you only have an avocado a month or every other week. You've got them. You don't have yeah. to go out and search for them and spend you know, the extra $10 Especially on them. Especially because if you're not making guacamole, you know, chances are you're not eating an entire avocado all in one sitting, so you will have half. That's why this makes so much sense, too, because it happens in every single kitchen. And if you're the one who, who does the cooking, you are looking at this right now saying, yeah, I've got these, you know, quarter of, you know, yeah. quarter used... Um, pieces. You know, pieces. And you're uh, storing air. It, it, that's right. And it's it taking up, up room. space. And you're tr constantly trying to move everything around in your refrigerator, trying to make room for something that might get pushed in the back and then you'll never see it again. And then you're going to throw it away anyway. Yep. Why not? And I love brightly colored. Why not store it in a way that sort of gives it a second skin? It's the best option for your fruits and vegetables. Glad to see so many of you are getting them. Four flex of four ninety nine, and look I at mean, the kiwi. And fun, so the smallest will go down to like a kiwi, a cucumber, a zucchini, a squash, like that. And the biggest, uh, where did my eggplant? Look, the biggest uh. will go up to an eggplant or even larger. Um, we have a spaghetti squash, oh you my guys. Gosh. So they're stretchy, so don't think that it's gonna be difficult. Like for example, I never use a whole eggplant. I mean, you'd have to be really hungry to do a whole <laughs> eggplant. So typically we need a half a quarter of an eggplant for whatever dish we're doing, ratatouille, or whatever, stew, soup. Yeah. Cut it, slice it, and now it will brown immediately. So give it a second skin. And all you do is pop it back in there. So I noticed a review out there, and we've got mostly perfect reviews, but I noticed a review and it was a negative review, and I think that that person was doing it wrong. Okay. Unfortunately, they didn't see the video, and you know, sometimes that happens. Instead of dragging it over or trying to pull it on, I want you to just place it on your countertop and take whatever half you're doing and hug it. Pop it on there and let those food huggers hug do the work. So yes. you're hugging your food. Yes. If you love your food, and we do, mm -hmm. because it nourishes our bodies and we spend a lot of money on it, if you love your food, give it a hug. Give That's my favorite. Hug. And this is, I never would have thought of this, but this is clever for your little Little portion controls your snacks oh, you can nice. actually take two of them and pop it together oh throw that in your gosh. purse so now you don't have a big isn't that cute so yeah. almonds or maybe that's your vitamins or whatever it is you know spices or seasonings whatever you want to put in there that's brilliant isn't that a cute little i mean so you're I gonna find it. all these ideas and uses for and these it's not coming apart until you take it apart until this you is, take it apart it helps to keep it fresh this is good it's cool this isn't is it? a really good I, you know out what, of all room. of the ideas the fruits <laughs> and the vegetables use them as a lid if you do need an extra lid you Use them on the go for those small little, um, you know, nuts and things like that that we take along with us. You got Just it. Just go ahead and get it. Over, you can see we're approaching 500 of these ordered just in this presentation, but these have been super popular. As a matter of fact, we haven't had it on since the last big holiday. Yeah, it's which been was a, almost a month. Holiday. Over That's a right. month, yeah. About a, a month. Yep. So... It's not something that you see all the time, but when you see it and you're saying, okay, that's pretty brilliant, mm -hmm. go ahead. It's not expensive either. Right. Because sometimes you see something that just saves a lot of time and money, and it costs a lot of money to get. This is not one this of those. This is not one of those. And by the way, a 10-pack you're getting. So I just want to remind you, if you're thinking, well, where am I going to put these? I thought the same thing. I got a lot of stuff in my house, right? I have a lot of items <laughs> in my kitchen. It all folds together. So let's say for whatever reason you're going on vacation and you are hugging no food at that moment. <laughs> Because, by the way, you'll never need to store them. They'll always be hugging your food. But let's say right. you're hugging no food. Go ahead and squeeze them together, and this will squeeze together. And you can see they take up no more than, I don't know, oh, two yeah. inches worth of room. That's not They're, even that's not even as much space as one of these oh, takes I up. mean, one of those. So those yeah. are these are storage solutions, but they're also storage problems. Because yeah. now, where am I going to put that? Right. Um, and so, I mean, you can see something as simple as, you know, one of the smaller compared tomatoes. Like, right there inside uh, my small food hugger. Or my lime. Or, mm -hmm. you know, I, I mean, the sky's the limit. I don't have to tell you what fruits and vegetables are and what you have in your home. We all... I can't imagine too many homes without any fruits and vegetables. Very true. And, you know, the, to be honest, like, maybe you're storing them wrong and you end up throwing this half a lime away. Um, here's... <laughs> 
This is one of our chefs here oh. at HSN. She brought this in and said, I'm guilty. Look how I was storing this onion. It's yeah. took, dried out and it's so dried out that it's, it's like growing things. That's right. <laughs> and you can grow you, like an onion plant or whatever. If you, they, if you did want to use it, then you have to cut half of the half away yes. in order to get to the fresh part again. Yes, ma'am. And again, that's just money and food that we are throwing away. And I don't know about you, every time I throw something away that could have been used better, stored better, eaten, you know, or what have are you. Are you so mad at yourself? It makes me so mad yeah. to see in the refrigerator because I so know true. that's money. You know, these things aren't free. No. So go for it. Because you're throwing your money away. It's not somebody else's. It's not like we're in high school anymore and we're throwing right. our parents' money away. That's true. I wish. That's you're what it was okay. your money away. Yeah, it's okay to throw somebody else. It's not even really okay, but it I feels better to throw kidding. somebody else's money away. <laughs> go for it. You're getting a 10-pack for the only place that you can find it. Um, and you get it for less than $20. If you want to get it on FlexPay, less than $5. And remember, buy more and save on shipping if you need more than a 10-pack. Kelly's staying <laughs> yeah. with us, right? Because she's got uh, the uh, the dash blender coming up. But let me share with you, because a lot of you are shopping with us on hsn.com, and great place to do it because you can shop for a lot of other things that you might be looking for. Maybe you're in the mood for um, a great, um, we've got a Cuisinart multifunction grill, griddle, and panini press. Um, and that's available right there on hsn.com. And what's really cool is that you can see all of the details about it. You can watch the video about it and learn even more. But that's a big customer pick on hsn.com. That and a lot of other items. So um, check that out. Keep on shopping um, and for your food savers, and we will continue on. Now, with Dash, where you unprocess your food, and in this case, with a very powerful Chef Series blender. With Dash, healthy is simple. your food with Dash. All right, well, Dash is one of the names that we love um, here in the kitchen at HSN because it is really about unprocess your food and really kind of open your mind to different ways to whether it's make drinks or baby food or smoothies or what have you. And in this case, the Chef Series Power Blender with the speed control. You could spend a lot of money on really great blenders. This is over 1,400 uh, watts of power. And we took $210 off <laughs> of our regular price. It's un. Believable. We never do it for this price, you guys. It's no. usually well over 200 on sale. Yeah. I mean, it's it's a great deal, great price. Um, I love this blender, and we'll talk about power really fast before I do this margarita, um, because most blenders that you buy that are 60 to $70, even upwards of $90, are about 300 watts, 400 watts. Bar blenders that are designed to blend drinks all day, every day, yeah. are up maybe 800, 900 watts on average. That's probably on the high side. This is 1,400 watts. This is twice what a bar blender is. <laughs> you guys this is more horsepower than the $600 V blender you know which one I'm talking about the name brand starts with a V and it's demonstrated in big box stores a lot of times we'll go shopping and we'll see them being demonstrated they're about $600 and you feel comfortable paying that or maybe not comfortable but you pay it because you're you're interested in getting a beautiful professional result look no further mm -hmm. this machine is unbelievable read the reviews it gets perfect reviews let's do our first one because we learn that people invest in a good blender because they want to do three things mainly mm -hmm. uh, frozen drinks hot soups and smoothies so we're going to start out with all three of those you guys <laughs> okay but what i always point out is our ice now if you've ever seen a blender demonstrated on television or elsewhere they use what i call fluffy tv ice it's like gas station ice, the kind you buy in the bag. It's really easy to crunch. This is not how your ice is made in a freezer. This is this is your freezer ice. This is difficult to blend. This is actually responsible for burning out motors on blenders. Mm -hmm. I point that out because this machine, it looks at it and blinks like it's, it is yeah. like nothing. Now yeah. that ice would damage other blender motors. Right. Um, we give you presets and manual settings. I love this machine because you can actually choose from smoothie, frozen, or soup, or you can choose a manual setting. But because I'm doing 
frozen right now. I'm gonna go ahead and select frozen. It's a beautiful display. All you do is select what you're doing or manual. And then I'm gonna go ahead and hit start. Um, and I'm gonna let this machine sort of wow you. Watch as my margarita is completely emulsified. In about four seconds, everything is completely pulverized. I know, the I ice mean, is gone. The <laughs> ice is completely gone. Now it will shut off because it's pre-programmed to know when to shut off when you choose that frozen section. That $600 blender, you have to toggle it. You yeah. have to stand there and go up and down and know about power and not yeah. this machine. When you select that presetting, you don't have to toggle anything. It knows how long to go. And I mean, you will never see, just check this out. A creamier, more smooth. Oh my gosh. No chunks, no bumps. There's not a piece of ice remaining. And not only that, but because wow. we give you so much power, it actually aerates it. So it gives you a really creamy, smooth texture. It's almost like you've added dairy somehow. It oh gives you that gosh. creamy of a texture. And that was in seconds. That was in counted. under 10 seconds. I mean, think about that. And Look it wasn't that. babying the machine. And that was the machine you're going to have on your countertop. And this is what you can do. Look at that. That is what it's a professional series blender than. gives you. And yeah. By the way, it's a three-year warranty. So if you're still sort of on the fence, think about it this way. Get it home, try it out. If it's not the best blender you've ever owned, send it back to us and call us and say it's not the best blender I've ever owned. <laughs> I promise you it is. Read the reviews on the website. Now, I made a mention that, you know, a lot of people want to do hot soups and hot fondues. Yeah. This has enough horsepower to cook your food to about 180, 190 degrees just based on the power of friction. I'm actually going to walk to our next studio okay. and start a hot soup and start a hot fondue during the live presentation we're going to cook them. Okay, so That's Kelly's going to go on and is. do that. And just, just to show you, because these are the kind of things that, like she said, people love to do and kind of test out with their blender. Um, this one is not only a customer pick, it is a huge customer pick, almost a perfect rating. It's 4.9 stars on this one. And you would expect that from something that costs closer to $400, which is what this normally costs. Even our regular sale quote unquote price is about $200. Today it's $169.95. And as we're showing you some of the things that it can do from making your soups hot to making real fresh peanut butter to making the fastest margarita you have ever had. By the time you realize you want to drink a margarita, your margarita's done, all right? And you've got $210 off of the regular HSN price. We, I want to make it a little, bit e uh, a little bit more affordable for you as well. Just for President's Day weekend, when you apply for and are approved for the HSN credit card, you can get up to $40 off of a single item purchase. That would make this now $129. You would be paying the lowest price of anybody ever, ever, ever. <laughs> so if um, if that's all you need, that just one little extra push, go for it. We're gonna go on over to Kelly so that you can see the soup getting hotter and hotter. All right, what's so cool is a lot of people spend that four, five, six hundred dollars on a blender because they think it has some sort of heating element. This machine does it, nor does that one. It's based on the power of friction. You have to have, you know, a two and a quarter horsepower motor to be able to get it hot enough to cook your food. Now, important distinction, it doesn't get over 212 degrees, so we're not boiling anything. You're not boiling any of the nutrition out. All I'm gonna do is hit soup. So I love that we give you the preset. So you can see on the inside of this machine, I have tomatoes, I, we have it in our broth, we have a beet, I have squash, I have celery celery, carrots, and then whatever spices and seasonings you choose. So salt, pepper, garlic, cilantro, whatever you want to do. And we're gonna, and this is not roasted. These are not softened. These are raw vegetables. This is what real food is meant to be. It's meant to taste like. And then right on the other side, I'm going to do something decadent. Um, we just had a little Valentine's Day, but there's always a holiday upcoming. Or, you know, you just want to have a great, beautiful dessert for your friends and family. I just have cream and then chocolate chunks. So we're going to make a beautiful hot fondue and a beautiful hot soup. Now, all I have to do is select soup soup, mind you, so I don't have to babysit this machine. I'm going to go ahead and hit start on both of these, and you're going to see um, that they're going to come to life. Basically, in five minutes, they're going to be cooked to perfection, and we're going to come back to them. So you can actually see the vegetables start to emulsify. Instantly, completely liquid. That's pretty cool because it happens so fast. And then right over here, I'm going to hit start on my fondue, and my chocolate fondue is starting as well. Just a few minutes, and we're going to showcase the steam pouring off of them and the fact that they're going to get over 180 degrees, which is that perfect temperature without getting out a pot or a pan or turning on your stove top. Dash just makes it that easy. Absolutely. And and so, okay, so Kelly's going to let those go, and they're just going to go 
on their own, right? Let me show you the colors too, so that you can go ahead and start shopping for your dash and your brand new blender. Black is by far the most popular. We also have it in red. It comes in blue and you can also see that you can get it in gray. So that's, you know, that's, those are your color options. You get it all. You're even going to get a nice little booklet that goes right along with it. And that tamper that you saw Kelly uh, using, that also comes included as well. Because sometimes you might, you know, you, if you have to, you know, stir something up, you've got a way to do that without having to use like the, the handle. Or open the lid. Yeah, open yeah. the lid and things like that. It's a nice feature to yeah. have. So remember I promised a beautiful mixed drink, a beautiful, you know, hot soup, and then also the most beautiful smoothies. So on the inside here, I have my spinach, I have my cucumber, I have my pineapple, some grapes. This could be your protein mix, your chia yeah. seed, whatever you want to do, your vitamins, your packets of whatever, pop it on the inside here. Um, and then we have a smoothie setting, which that's pretty cool because this actually knows what power a smoothie needs, okay? But most of the time you see blenders, um, you know, again, demonstrated, if you've ever seen another blender demonstrated, and they add water at this point or orange juice or coconut water or some kind of a liquid. And the reason that they do that is that their motor isn't powerful enough to take solid food and turn it into a liquid without adding a liquid. They need sort of that, you know, lubrication in there. Okay. Not with this machine. We can actually take solid food and turn it right into a liquid so you're not watering down your smoothie. All you're getting is the most beautiful, perfect vitamins, minerals, and nutrients. So I'm gonna choose smoothie. You can okay. see I have just solid fruits and vegetables. That's pulsing on its own. You're not toggling. You don't have to babysit it or stand by it or wonder, you know, if you're at the right, you know, level. It knows what level it needs and it knows how long it needs. So typically with our smoothies, it's about 30 seconds. Okay. But I happen to know we're done because yeah. you can see obviously we're and done. And if for if you know you just wanted to do it on your own, there is also that manual there option. There is a too. manual option. Yeah. Absolutely, you don't have to use smoothie if you don't want to. But this is going to be Tamara's breakfast, I'm guessing. Oh yeah. But look at the beautiful color. And what's so cool? And let me get my spoon back out as I finish. There are no chunks. There are no bumps. There is nothing. There's no fruits and vegetables that haven't been completely That's emulsified. Right. I'm not chewing my You're drink. You're not <laughs> chewing your smoothie. I always giggle. Even when you go to the smoothie store, they give you what's called a smoothie straw. That's yeah. a thing. A smoothie straw is a thing. It's about this big around. <laughs> And I'm like, why am I paying you $8 to give me a smoothie that I'm going to be chewing? That's not a smoothie. Right. That's a chunky. Or I don't even know what that is. That's right. But with the Dash Blender, it is going to completely emulsify solid. Remember, that was solid fruits and vegetables. It's now completely liquefied and emulsified. And what I mean by emulsification is when you burst into the plant cell walls and you open up the plant cell walls and then you drink them, your body can immediately absorb them. It's mm. actually more efficient than even chewing your fruits and vegetables. So that that's why smoothies and juicing are so popular in the sort of the health industry is because it's a more efficient way to process those fruits and vegetables. And it's also easier than chewing them. So if you make a smoothie, a green smoothie like Tamara's drinking, yeah. you don't even, like you skip the coffee that morning. Mm -hmm. It's going to instantly give you energy because it's, you've burst open the cell walls and you're absorbing that nutrition. This is so Isn't good. Isn't that amazing? <laughs> and, and I'm just drinking it down. I'm not chewing. Nothing's yes. getting stuck in my teeth. This is fantastic. I know. And that's, a, you read the, people love this for smoothies. So we did our mixed drink. We did our smoothie. We've got our hot soup going. Mm -hmm. This machine will replace all kinds of items if you're in your kitchen, your food processor, your ice cream maker, you know, get rid of them, your coffee grinder. Yeah. Um, we were talking about gadgets, kind of having yes. too many gadgets around yes. the house. If you wanted to streamline what's in your kitchen and your cabinets and things like that. Yes. The dash. That's how you do it. So I'm gonna go ahead and we've used all of our presets. I'm gonna use the manual setting just to show you everything. Inside here is just raw peanuts, or excuse me, not raw peanuts, honey roasted peanuts. But this could be raw peanuts, this could be regular peanuts. Mm -hmm. And most blenders need the addition of an oil right here. Remember mm -hmm. I talked about having to add a liquid? When they, when they don't have power, they need liquid, okay. okay? We don't need oil to extract our peanut butter oil. So I'm gonna start and you can just see I'm gonna use the slow setting, that's slow. All right, and then I'm just gonna switch it all the way to high because we're gonna make a nut butter. Okay. And this is where you would use the tamper. All right. Order. 
just so you know, that's about a third of the quantity that we have um, uh, for the entire day. About uh, So this is going to be your opportunity to go ahead and get the dash Chef Series Power Blender. Look at that. And nut butters, I tell you, in the stores. Oh, they're outrageous. They're especially if you get the uh, organic kind. Oh, especially. If you've never looked at the back of your peanut butter oh. jar, I'm not trying to freak you no, out. No, it I'm scares not, you. It scares you. Mm -hmm. Peanut butter is a health food. Let's be honest. It is an incredibly healthy food. But mm -hmm. a lot of times manufacturers, to keep things on the shelf for a year or two, yeah. or whatever their reasoning is, they have to add preservatives and chemicals and sodium and this or that. Mm -hmm. And therefore, you're health food becomes not so healthy anymore. That's right. When Dash came up with their motto, unprocess their, your food, they were very literal. They want to give you items that help you unprocess it, meaning get the preservatives, yeah. the chemicals, the sodium, the junk, the additives, the artificial colors out. Yeah. So imagine just going and buying raw almonds and doing your own almond oh butter gosh. and adding cinnamon or a tad That's bit of right. salt. That's right. You can do your own yeah. nut butters. It could be cashew butter at the holidays and, and give can, it as gifts. And that's the deal. You could do a different kind every single day. You and don't have you to see commit to just seconds. one. And I like that it doesn't have, you mentioned looking at the back of the ingredient label, um, it doesn't have sugar in it. It doesn't have things that you can't pronounce in it because sometimes when we think we're doing something good for our family and then you actually read what's in the food that you're giving them, you're thinking, how in the world? I thought this was a good option. But now, because you can do it yourself, uh, now it can be a good option, a better option for you. So we started off with the margarita, which is still nice and fluffy. Nothing has separated. I've got my smoothie. Nothing has separated. Did you notice that? We did the nut butter. You're going to go on over and see the soup as well. Kelly, is the soup hot? steam pouring out the top over here on our um, on our fondue I'm going to reveal them both but I mean just to just to give you that example that's the type of power that we're dealing with when we talk about two and a quarter horsepower that was raw ingredients just a few minutes ago and now you can see steam pouring out the top now this is my tomato or my my vegetable soup this is what vegetable soup should look like you guys um, we get so used to seeing the stuff in the cans and unfortunately a lot of cans of soup look at the steam pouring out the top have artificial colorings or preservatives or chemicals or sodium whatever your reason is for wanting to eat healthier whether you're just eating healthier because it gosh darn it tastes better I'm okay with that reason <laughs> um, whatever your reason for wanting to do healthier is uh, this this machine makes it easy so I don't have to you know do my soup and then put it on a stovetop you know a lot of blenders will blend but they won't cook it to yeah. you know the right temperature and then you have to get out another pot or a pan and put it on the stovetop that's the color tomato soup should be you that guys, looks so it's that good. beautiful orange color, depending on what vegetables, obviously, you pop in there. Um, but, you know, when we get out a can, it's like this bright red color that you think doesn't look natural or doesn't come from nature. And sometimes it doesn't. I mean, we have to be very honest with ourselves. And then even if you want to do something decadent, at least I know that my ingredients that were put in here were whole and real. So we just had chocolate and cream. So those are very whole, real ingredients. That's real food. Your body knows how to process real food. Your body doesn't know how to process chemicals. So imagine doing this as a dessert, you know, for, you know, a gathering if you're having a dinner party or just for you and your spouse or you and your sweetheart or... Oh, Wow. Instead of spending $50, $60 on chocolate-covered strawberries, you can dip them yourself, you guys. I mean, that's the truth of the matter. But uh, if you've ever done chocolate-covered strawberries, please do me a favor and do chocolate-covered... Um, oh, I lost that one. I'm not going to go <laughs> digging for it. Chocolate-covered pineapple because it's equally as decadent. Ooh. So just get some fresh pineapple and pop it in there. But those are the types of things that Dash allows us to do with this machine. With All we have to do is select soup press a button and walk away. You're not babysitting it. You're not toggling it. You're not worried of whether or not it's doing its job. It's doing its job. It's Dash. Read the reviews. People go crazy for this blender. It really is a professional quality blender. Very true. And that was five minutes. Five minutes from the time you decide what kind of soup you want and put the ingredients in there. You are five minutes to having a nice hot bowl of soup. That's a good point. That's I love the deal. that point. From the time you decide, you know what, strawberries are in season. I've got some in my refrigerator. I would love to have some uh, chocolate sauce to dip into mm -hmm. it. You're five minutes away. And that's, wh that's why we're stressing the power. Because if any of all of the kitchen, let's say, gadgets that we have in our kitchen that we've ever had in our kitchen over our lifetime, the blenders are probably the ones that you've bought over and over and over that you've had to throw away. Because we all started off with a $20 blender because we thought, well, What's the difference? Oh, yes. And then we found out the difference. And then we stepped up to a $40 blender and then maybe a $60 blender. 
Uh, this one, these normally should be closer to $400, and the good ones are, right? Today, it is not. Five flex payments of $33.99. The last blender you'll ever have to buy. It is. And that's the deal. It's because and it's it, powerful. And we're giving you a three-year warranty. Not to say it's not going to last you double, triple times that, but we're just saying in within three years from the time you get this, if you have any kind of issue with it, which you won't, because it's all metal to metal gear. So you're oh, not, yeah, there's no part, plastic parts and pieces. That's a metal gear. Uh, I can't flip this over because there's liquid in it. But yeah, there you go. That's a metal gear. So a lot of, a lot of blenders, even some of the expensive ones, you flip those over and really start to dissect them, they're plastic. Mm -hmm. um, so we give you steel to steel construction. That's the reason you can hear the growl, the motor, really like uh, Tamara said, it's hungry, it wants to work. It's like, what you got for me? Yeah, oh yeah. <laughs> so this is frozen strawberries and this could be any frozen fruit. And by the way, don't thaw them in the least, take them right out of the freezer. And then we have skim milk right here, but this could be frozen bananas, frozen mango, frozen blueberries, frozen anything, you guys. Okay. We're making a sorbet, but if you wanted to do ice cream, you add, you know, cream. But if you're dairy free, you could do almond milk or soy milk or oh. coconut milk. Coconut, can yes. I do, okay. You can do coconut milk, absolutely. This now becomes a dessert you can eat without any guilt. Because we're not Ooh. even adding anything sweetener because this will extract that there will be sugar in this because obviously there's sugar in strawberries. Um, but it's the natural sugar from the strawberries, which is so much better than any kind of processed sugar. Um, you could select frozen or you can select manual. Again, that's up to you. How fast do you want things to happen? I'm gonna pop it over to manual. Maybe 15 seconds. If that! To a whole bag of frozen berries. And not just that, look at this. Oh my gosh. Now, I love showcasing that because that is our quad blade technology. You don't see that very often, but you can see clearly there are four blades pulling down every bit of your food so that it can blend it to perfection. Now, look at this consistency. Oh, wow. Oh, I have it broken. I mean, that was cream. 15 seconds. 15 to sorbet. seconds to sorbet. But that didn't have to be frozen strawberries. Fresh. That could be bananas, mango, oh. whatever. Whatever fruit you want to do, if you want to, you know, get some fresh fruit and freeze it so that you get that consistency. But it's like the consistency of soft serve, but even better. Because look at it, it sticks oh. to the spoon. I know, Tamara. I'm you got sorry. Go I just got to, I'm sorry. It, I know. But it's guilt free because it's oh all, two ingredients. <laughs> I've never met an a, a ice cream or a sorbet on the market that's two ingredients. Never. And now, you never will. <laughs> and, and, and those, you can't pronounce half the things that are in mm. those. So this you can pronounce mm. strawberry and milk. I mean, Love. we got to get back to sort of eating real. Our body doesn't know how to process chemicals. It's that's right. It gets confused. Mm -hmm. it's, it's not good for us. We know that. Well, I don't have to tell you that. Yeah. But our body knows how to process food because yeah. that's what we were designed to do. Mm -hmm. And so when you get back to the basics of just doing whole foods, no yeah. matter what it is, even if it's decadent like the chocolate, at least it's whole real food. You know what I mean? Yeah, absolutely. That was good. Isn't and I'm amazing? telling you, I know in your mind what you're thinking is you're trying to remember everything Kelly's making because you're going to do it as soon as you get home. <laughs> you are going to get a booklet, which is great. Um, the idea is make what you want. Yes. Eat, if it's real food that you want, then put real food in yes, there. Yes, ma'am. I love this demonstration too because it also shows that fast power and that was maybe 30 seconds, um, was I took a dollar bag of white rice and I turned it into my own gluten-free flour. Wow. Now you could do hard, you know, uncooked chickpeas or oats, anything that's naturally gluten-free to turn it into a flour, pop it on the inside here. Okay. Now you can make gluten-free pancakes, gluten-free cookies, gluten-free oh, muffins, wow. gluten-free fried food batter. My, my brother is gluten-free, he cannot process gluten. Yeah. Um, he, I said, oh, what do you miss the most? Like cookies or yeah. breads or what do you miss the most? Right. He said, honestly, I miss fried foods the most because when you go to a restaurant, they they absolutely cannot tell you that their their fried food batter is gluten free. He said I never can get sort of you know crunchy wings or crunchy mm -hmm. fried pickles or crunchy fried chicken anymore. Mm -hmm. And so now you can make your own gluten free flour for a dollar instead of going to the Sweet. health food store and spending like eleven bucks on a little bag. And, and I'll tell you in our last twenty seconds because I know our clock is quickly running out. How about making your own ground coffee? Get rid of that coffee yeah, grinder, I you know. guys. This is going to do. This actually will grind it into espresso. It'll grind it that fine. Oh my gosh. Okay. So while you're seeing that, remember we've got it for you. Black, gray, red, or blue. Um, they're all popular. I think a lot of you are going for the black one this morning. Look at how you can have fresh ground coffee every morning without having to 
have a separate separate coffee grinder. Yeah, get rid of it. Go through yeah. your cabinet and clean it out. For sure. This will replace appliances. And you know what? It's not always going to be this price. It's a spring price where we took $210 off free shipping and on FlexPay. All right. So enjoy that. Stay on the phone for those. Um, also available from Dash, we have the two-pack of the mini rice cookers. Those have been so popular. Yeah, those are great. And it just makes it convenient because like Kelly was telling me, you know, you could do rice in one and chili in one. Yeah, you can use them both or you can keep one and give one away. You can keep one funny. at home, take one to the work. Or take one to work yeah. or keep one at home, give one to your best friend, your sister-in-law, whatever you want to do. Send it off to um, school if you have a student off in college. Oh, yes. They can't really Good. like have an open flame in their dorm room, yes, but they can, they can you know, plug in. Yes, they I, can. Even when I was in college, we, we could plug in. That's yes, right. Yes. <laughs> you could do that. All right, and it's a great price there. Can't believe those are $29.95. Kelly, thank you. All right, Tamara, I'll save you, I'll save you some. Maybe so we'll see you back at three. We've got more coming up. Anthony is on the way. The HSN mobile app is convenient and easy to use for all of your HSN shopping needs. On the app, it's so easy to find the item you want and place your order within seconds. Read the product descriptions and reviews before you purchase, or watch a live feed of HSN and purchase the airing item and other items that have recently aired. Just go to hsn.com and search app to download now. It's HSN's President's Day Sale. Enjoy four days of special pricing on some of your favorite brands, like Samsung, Bissell, and Joy Mangano. Don't miss other exclusive offers, like four or more flex pay on everything all weekend long. Free shipping on all electronics. Free shipping on all Simmons Beauty Rest mattresses. Plus, daily flash sales, 50% off or more. Check back each day on hsn.com. HSN's President's Day Sale, now through Monday, only on HSN. Don't miss the fashion edit premiere of the Melissa McCarthy 77 Spring Collection. If you're shorter, taller, whatever size you are, to look your most beautiful, I think you have to be comfortable. And join Melissa McCarthy as she takes on New York City, giving real women the fashion surprise of a lifetime. The Fashion Edit, Melissa McCarthy Fashion, Styling Manhattan, only on HSN.